What's up guys? Today we are going to do some trout fishing and I'm not sure if they stock this section right here because the stock section is over there and there's like a thousand people because it's like fall fishing, fall stock trout fishing. So I'm fishing right here where there's nobody but freaking highway stuff. So uh, let's see if I can get some fish to bite. This is my first time trout fishing with my Daiwa Alphas Air. Upgraded to Roro Spool and the Roro Bearings. And um, yeah, we'll try various lures. The first lure I'll try is the Z Spender from Euro Tackle. I swapped the single hook, by the way. Let's do it. All right, guys, this jerkbait's not doing too well here. I don't want to say it's the jerkbait's fault because, you know, jerkbait is great for trout. But as I say, likely they may not have stocked this area. Because of COVID-19, they usually probably like dump it at the main hot spot and just leave because they're short on staff. So I'm going to change lure and I might have to hike back and fish the highly pressured area in the front over there. Hi, uh, no likey. All right, boys and girls. Man, these people right there cutting up their trout. People finally done their fishing. So Jimbo could take my spot here. Yee, yee. All right, look at that. People gutting their fish and throwing it into the water here, floating downstream. It's crazy. Oh, yeah. There we go. This is a good battle. Oh yeah, first trout. Oh, my Alpha's air. Dude, this is a nice trout. Uh, that's what I'm talking about. Throwing this 3.5 gram spoon. Oh man. Look at that beautiful fall colors. That's what I call good battle right here. Oh man. Here we go. Come to Papa Jimbo. He's battling at the end. Come on. I should have my net on the left side. One hand reeling, boys and girls. Over the head. Bam. Woof. Dude, oh, he unhooked himself. Perfect. But Jimbo wants to take one photo. Hopefully, and hopefully, it'll be a perfect one for you guys on the thumbnail. So yeah, guys, as you see, there's so many people here. I was here like uh, 8 a.m. It's already fall. And those people are cleaning their trout here right now, letting their guts float downstream. But Jimbo's gonna stay here, fish this bridge, this noisy bridge, because that's all I have right now. Not a bad way to fish a bridge is that you fish from the upstream side and you cast into the water and you basically let the current uh, move your bait. See that right there, the spoon? You just reel in very slow. So you basically cast on an angle and let it swing over to where you think uh, the fish are at. It's just slow reel it. Oh, something just napped me. All right, guys, the next. Lure I'll throw is a Euro Tackle Z Spender. This is the jerk bait, and I swapped out the single hooks. We'll see if uh, having single hooks would mean less hookup ratio and also more drops. So let's check it out. So for me, I fish uh, jerk bait very similar to the spoon, especially when I fish like bridges. I stay on the upstream side, and what I do is I just let the current take it, and eventually your crankbait, jerk bait, will dive down, and I slowly just Reel it in just to keep it, you know, uh, lower in the water column. And I just let it swing. So I always cast in a diagonal so that, you know, what happened is if you stay still, you see the lure is going downstream, but eventually, because I'm not feeding any more line, it actually curves over. You're just drifting it. The swing is the key. You swing it, let the trout see it, and you slowly reel it back in. That is the technique. Super easy. Oh, 
Here we go. Got one. Oh, yeah. Dude, this guy can battle. The only thing that's bad about this catcher is the freaking motorcycle sound and all the cars are drive right above me. But you know, in fall time, they stock all the trout at the bridges and it's move on. So it sucks. All right, all right, this one's definitely a lot better than the first one. Ooh, yeah. All right, easy. Oh, I think it popped it off already. But look at that. All right, Jimbo needs to his hand. Oh, he popped off himself. But guys, the Euro tackle with the single hook, it works, man. Still works. First bite, 100% hookup, no drops, perfect. All right, look at it one last time. Off it goes. All right. Sometimes you can just cast it out, let the current drift, and you just do social media. That's what I'm doing. Oh, got hit. Social mediaing and getting hits, that's what I'm talking about. Got him. <laughs> that is what I'm talking about. Oh yeah. I can do this all day long. I'm kind of glad that the other folks just got their trout and left because I went all the way down over there and there's like no fish because the people just stopped at the main spot, and that's it. But Jimbo's not gonna keep any of these trout today, but this one is extremely beautiful. Like, look at the colors. You guys, death rolling like crazy. I gotta get this one in. But I do wanna photo this because I love this color. Like, oh my lord. This is freaking amazing. This gotta be the most beautiful rainbow trout I've caught. Like, it's so rosy. All right. Oh, man. oh, yeah. guys, look at this rosy trout. Look at that. He's thick, too. Uh, he death rolled the lure off, which is good, but I need him to get around it. It's on my hook. I mean, it's on my net. Hold up, hold up. Chill, 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 chill. Trying to make sure you don't death roll back onto the hook, dude. Lucky these are all single hooks. So, hey, 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 easy. But man, look at that beautiful, this, I think it's a male, cause it's like poke chin. But let me take a photo of this. This is freaking amazing. Got a crappy. Yoink. Not the black nose crappy, but uh, cool. Look at that. Small little crappy. Hey! 
Hey, dude, it's a crappy day. All day long. All right. Looking for the black nose crappy, but not here, not today. Trout magnet time. Hey. Right there. Oh, oh, Jesus, rock bass in the rocks, I think, oh yeah, dude, that is what I'm talking about, these guys are freaking monsters, look at that guys, rock bass, Large on bass. Jeez, so beautiful. All right, folks, now that's just fall fishing. Pretty bad, especially with uh, weekend warriors like me. Uh, <laughs> sometimes being dad is tough. You gotta pick your battles. And today, only got that few trout, but at least I did a little trout magnet fishing right over there by the falls. I know you guys all love trout magnet uh, with the BFS here. I did it, but I'll say, man, it's so windy there. Maybe because the water coming down and generate the energy, right? And uh, it was pretty tough to cast. No lie, it was pretty tough to cast. But anyhow, um, if you guys want to see more trout fishing this fall, please leave me a comment below. I definitely could give it another shot. Uh, probably South Jersey, gotta be on kayaks instead because it's just so tough to locate these trout, no, not knowing where they dump it, right? And uh, being on the South Jersey Lake, which I don't really like fishing for trout, you know, there's still other fish to fish for, like crappies, perch, right? Bass, pickerels, and uh, BFS fishing on a kayak for those trout. Sounds like it's a good plan, at least to me. Anyway, guys, the fish don't wait. Make sure you guys get out there early, hit up your spots that you need to go, and catch those fish. Peace out.